Colonel Byer. Mary should be online shortly. Thanks, Dicta. Right. Agent, again, thanks for making it in here so quickly. I know it's short notice. At 0200 hours this morning, one of our high security R&D black sites came under attack. The target was an IFA facility in the Northern Territory. A hostile force infiltrated the site and placed it under lockdown. We need to get in there ASAP and keep our people safe. For now, our only option is to send you in via Aspire. That's right, the Aspire program is being revived over a year after the powers that be shelved it. This is our last chance to prove the thing will work. A one-time opportunity. This is Operation Sinon. Possess the Aspire unit, secure the facility, and open the place up for our people. Time is of the essence. Baker? All green, Colonel Pyre. 26 Aspire units detected in the facility, only one accessible via back door, and primed. Uber marionette online, Mary synchronization, 100%. Okay, we'll brief you further as you go. Possessing Aspire unit, now. Looks like our back door worked. Hmm, cradle doors are jammed. Agent, use the emergency handle to open them. Now checking basic functionality. Agent, can you move around the lab for us? Use the motion controllers in your hands to move the Aspire unit. No melters over here. Movement on IK neural networks looking stable. Hmm. Looks like the only way out is up. Agent, grab any metal surface or any edge to climb. Aspire's hands are full of high-powered actuators and electromagnets. Clench your fists to grab... Agent, you're now commandeering a prototype Alpha Aspire unit. No bells and whistles on this one. Mary connection completely stable at almost 3,000 clicks. First objective is to find a weapon. Should be something in my office. Head there. Ah, the old stomping ground. I can't believe they left it all like this. Wait, before you leave, you should calibrate the Aspire unit. Hmm, you'll need a repair tool as well. Stand over the holographic feet to start... Okay, Agent, to carry equipment, we need to calibrate a few things. First up, your utility belt. Pull both triggers in thin air to show the utility belt. Then carefully position and resize the... Release the triggers to confirm the positions. Next, we'll position your chest holsters. Place your hands on your chest, as indicated, and squeeze the triggers. Release the triggers to confirm the positions. How does it feel? Everything match up? Pull both triggers and release the triggers to confirm the positions. How does it feel? Everything match up? Place your hands on your chest as indicated. Release the triggers to confirm the positions. How does it feel? Everything match up? Now, aim your hand at the repair tool and press to holster any weapons or items. Simply drop them near your chest. Okay, you're ready. Head out into the hall. How does it feel? Everything match up? Place your hands on your chest, release the triggers to confirm the positions. How does it feel? Everything match up? Okay, you're ready. 
Head out into the hall. You've taken damage. Repair tool on your chest. Use it on the nodes. Pull the trigger over the damage orbs. Good. Okay, it's been a while. There should be a pneumatic pistol on the desk upstairs. Objective complete. Tranquilizer rounds only. Should be almost completely silent. Try firing around. It's not automatic. Pull the piston back to ready another dart. You'll need to reload it. Swipe the weapon near the magazine on your waist and Aspire will automatically reload. To holster your weapon, let go of it anywhere near your chest or waist. Aspire will magnetize it to a halt. To get out of here, you'll have to break the lock off that air vent. Why don't you shoot it with the Trank pistol? To get out of here, you'll have to break the lock off that air vent. Why don't you shoot it with the Trank pistol? You'll have to crouch to get in there. Just duck into the air vent. Aspire will mimic your body movements. Agent crouched to get into the vent in my office. <laughs> so, uh, you keep a padlock on your air vent and a trank pistol on your desk. I'm very interested in security, all right? This is 1-5 Delta. 10-43, I think I've hit the payload. Over. HQ, do you copy? This is 1-5 Delta. Over. Shit. <laughs> Good luck transmitting through the RF jammer, Chief. Thank you. 
Mary says the unit's chassis has been impaired. Find a quiet spot and fix the damage with your repair tool. They've called off the search, but proceed with caution. They know you're here now. They've lowered the security level. Don't let them discover you again. Boss says this might be the place. If you find the payload, call it in straight away. CO will check in on the quarter hour. HQ, this is 1-4 Bravo. 1020, securing the fall division. Over. Agent, if you get lost, take your repair tool and drop it on the ground. It'll show a path towards the next objective. Agent, the main shutter door is locked. To open it, flip the breaker switch. You can see it up near the ceiling on the gantry. Let's do another round. Oh, oh no, 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 please. They've lowered the security level. Don't let them discover you again.
for receiving damage. You've taken damage. Repair tool on your chest. Use it on the nodes. Says the unit's chassis has been impaired. Find a quiet spot and fix the damage with your repair tube. Oh, Be careful, the enemy is going to be much more vigilant now. Agent, your objectives are twofold. First, unlock the facility so that our troops can get in. Our guys are prime for the go code. Second, find out who is attacking the facility. We don't have eyes inside the base, so you'll need to handle anything else that comes up on the fly. Our AI puppet string system, Mary, is translating your actions onto the Aspire unit. She'll be giving us live feeds from your unit's sensors. chassis acts as a huge aerial that hooks up to a 10G network. Without constant connection to our servers and Mary, the thing wouldn't work. Yeah, 10G. You probably haven't heard of it. 10th generation wireless mobile telecommunications technology is still very much a military only thing. Maybe I shouldn't have said that. The Aspire chassis acts as a huge aerial that hooks up to a 10G network. Without constant connection to our servers and Mary, the thing wouldn't work. Yeah, 10G. You probably haven't heard of it. 10th generation wireless mobile telecommunications technology is still very much a military only thing. Maybe I shouldn't have said that. So 
we finally get the Mary AI system working by remote possession, but while our offices are under siege, I can't believe it. Hopefully this is enough to get the project back on track. Agent, keep moving through the facility. Primary goal is still to reach the surface. Open the base up for our troops. The Aspire chassis acts as a huge aerial that hooks up to a 10G network. Without constant connection to our servers and Mary, the thing wouldn't work. Yeah, 10G. You probably haven't heard of it. 10th generation wireless mobile telecommunications technology is still very much a military only thing. Maybe I shouldn't have said that. Objective complete. This is hardware engineering. Agent, we've lost contact with the Aspire units back in the lab, but these showcase models will make for a nice backup. Use the repair tool on the control panel to power them up. Agent, use the repair tool to activate those showcase Aspire models. They're great. These units are now live. If you lose the one you're currently in, you can possess one of these new units. Welcome behind the scenes, Agent. This is where blood, sweat and tears went into developing the Aspire unit's protective armour. Your current prototype is, uh, pretty lacking in that regard. scale model of the Aspire central battery unit. Lightning in a bottle, basically. Inside is a matrix of graphing supercapacitors for quick charge, long haul, and rapid discharge. Throughout the chassis is a supporting network of graphene oxide foam, a malleable 3D battery substance. Patent pending. This stuff runs under the skin all around the unit's skeleton and feeds the actuators, magnets, and sensors with quick hit energy when required. We can even charge Aspire up while you stand there listening to me explain. You've evaded capture. Lie low, they'll be on the lookout. One of the Aspire Project's many, many cast-offs. As far as we know, we were developing the most advanced telepresence robot in the world. <laughs> Turned out to be easier said than done. Mirroring a person's every movement to a, a huge metal puppet is not a simple task. The Mary AI system was developed to make an AI interface between you and all the cogs of the machinery. Even one of the Uber Marionette's knees has an attached AI system, which links up with the legs AI, which links up with the central nervous AI. And Mary manages all these systems, feeds them goals. You are the puppet master. Mary is the strings. Don't hurt me.
lowered the security level. Don't let them discover you again. Agent, the unit is on its last legs. Use the repair tool to fix it, now! Remember this place, Agent? Your first rodeo. This is where the magic happened. There's a Beta Aspire model behind the security glass. It's beefier than your current Alpha unit, but... Ah, it's locked up tight. Agent, to access the Beta unit, you'll need to get upstairs to the power platform and run a power cycle. It's up above you. Get up there and I'll walk you through the process. Then you'll have some real power at your fingertips. Good, the power platform. There are four breakers. You need to flip them all to start the system up. There's the first breaker. Flip the switch. Now get to the other three and flip them too.
There are four breakers. You need to flip them all to start the system up. Now head over to the master panel and flip the mains breaker. HQ, this is 1-3 Kilo. Huge power surge in the fall division. We're going in. Over. The path to the Aspire control deck is now open. Head back downstairs and get in there. Drop the repair tool on the floor to see your waypoint. 